Hello! <laughs> Yokosor! How is... Uh, wrong emote. How's everyone? <laughs> I should have unrigged my mouth while doing this little dance because I'm always dancing, dancing mouth closed. Not dirty dino, I just misclicked the, the sweat one. It's, it's a part. The dancing one and the sweat one are emotes out of the numpad of the keyboard let me see if i can get this closer <laughs> you will hear my nose as well but fuck you <laughs> i'm just kidding but today my voice is not um let's see my tone sales according to google translate if you guys don't know what is amygdala maybe you know what is a Tone seal. Amygdala. Tone seal. Yes, those things of mine are hurting for some reason today. Eh. Actually, it's been like that for three days now. But I thought it was just a morning thing. I gotta take more amygdala that a bloodborne boss no but it's bloody it's a thing in the corner of your uh, mouth let me let me open mine ah uh, can you see the mouth here in the side of your throat in this side of your throat you can uh, have that thing hurting <laughs> between it's like in between your throat there's a little punching punching bag and on the sides those are the amygdala i'm gonna be be better soon maybe it's just winter stuff or screaming stuff but i i'm already taking ibuprofen and drinking uh, ginger disgusting ginger tea <laughs> I hate it. I hate it so much. I hate ginger. <laughs> Let me see. Um, my game. My game won't work if I'm not full screen in the game. So I will switch background music for the game music. Is this off? On? Not this? There we go. Cursed. <laughs> Hydration redeem chug ginger. Hell no. You guys won't see that day coming. Never. No. Uh-uh. Uh last stream we were <laughs> we were king shaming crane for his weird fetishes with snow white, but now that I think about it, maybe he's not the culprit. But still, because I'm doing the jackass wrote. I killed some people and now I think I'm gonna uh, argue with my consequences. What is this? In ship's clothing? I knew this guy was bad. His beard was not blue. Can't afford to look human. You're going to the farm. It's as simple as that. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? 
I can't finish the mirror. It's missing a piece. Crane must have taken a shot at him. The open arms. Enjoy your stay. Thanks, Bigby. And thanks for covering for me last time, too. Bigby? How could you do this to me? I guess I finally see you. For who you are. <laughs> tell me who did it. Just tell me who did it. I know you know. I don't think he did it. What? Look at him. Do you really think this man murdered these women? Oh, wow, wow, wow. Yeah, remember this. Furry man! <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> You little bitch. Long live the queen. I'm gonna make you swallow that ugly beanie of yours. <laughs> oh, is that my blood? Deformed and shredded on impact. He'll be okay, though. Hmm? He'll be okay? His internal organs are positively riddled. Oh man, I looked if fucked I don't up. Every single scrap of silver. He's liable to suffer some long term toxicosis. Easy there. Try not to move. figured I'd be done before you were conscious. My arm! Yes, very ugly, but not life-threatening. I can't say the same for these bullets peppered throughout your vital organs. You don't move it. Doctor. Look, I'm a bit engaged setting his life at the moment, but if the fractured extremity concerns him that much, he can set it himself. Oh, I can? Can I put it in place? Oh, que nojo! Disgusting! It didn't work. Again. Ew, ew, ew. Disgusting, disgusting. Is it in place? Yeah? Hmm. Not bad. That'll do, I suppose. Now just put he some flex alive. tape in there. <laughs> he won't be next time if he keeps going like this. He didn't listen to me before. Maybe he'll listen to you. I don't know about that. Well, he should. There are limits to what even I can do. <laughs> it's not like I asked for this shit to happen. Yes, but it's not like you actively discouraged it either. <laughs> He's got a point. Can you guys hear the characters well? Perhaps it'd be better if you gave me a few minutes to finish with it. I think I should stay, at least until he's out of the woods. Believe me, Bigby couldn't be in better hands. And I need the space to work, so if you wouldn't mind. Don't worry, Snow. I'll be okay. We'll be done in a moment. Just please, give us the time. Hey Don, how much longer? Colin, leave him be. <laughs> he looks so sarcastic, the pig. Because I watched a vet so a turtle together in ten minutes flat. Colin, you're not even supposed to be here right now. Oh really? Where am I supposed to be? I'm here to take care of my friend. With what? Your hooves? Hey, let Colin, shut the hell up, will ya? Yes, that would be. <laughs> okay, thank you, Tuscanogi. <sighs> there, all done. 
Great. Those look like teeth, this not bullets. You should keep to having visits with me, and well, this time, this time was no joke. Eat as many metal shellings as you see fit, but take just one more silver round near your heart, and the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. Eesh. Miss White, you'll be fine for light duty, if you can figure out what that means. He knows what it means. I don't know what he means. <laughs> An unusual couple of days. I know, but please, don't give him the excuse. His body will eventually give out. Take care of it. Please. I will. He'll need rest, I assume. You know, my dad. I don't need a babysitter. I can look after myself. Clearly. <laughs> Anyways, guard against, as they say. Miss White, Sheriff, Colin, Swiney. But you're the pig. <laughs> Oh, there he goes again. You wanna die that fast? So, how do you, um, feel? It's Big B, Snow. He'll be okay. Hell, I seen him take worse. Not as good as can be expected. I think. So, not well then. I'm glad you're not dead. Thank you, Snow. You, uh, you stopped breathing, you know, when you passed out or, or died, I guess. No beer. Beer is bad for you. It kind of scared the hell out of me. Oh, Snow is worried. I've never seen you like um, that. Um, I'm here for you, baby. <laughs> and even he thought you were... Snow, I'd never leave you. Like when you take an action figure and bend its limbs the wrong way. <laughs> Colin. I'm just saying I was worried about him is all. The guy hasn't had a night's rest in days. Well, I'll get some rest when this whole thing is done. What whole thing? God damn it, go be What's go be your eye. <laughs> I mean, do you guys have like a plan or something? <laughs> Fight Tusk and Doggy. Drink I beer. Be should I be worried about the crooked man taking over? Snow's the boss. She'll know what's best for the community. Thanks. The crooked man came out of the shadows for a reason. For him to attack us so The crooked man. He either feels invincible or desperate. Well, if those are my two options, I don't think I'd pick desperate. What do you mean? You traded Crane to save Bigby. I'm just saying that's oh, not exactly choice. something you do when you're playing with house money. So he called my bluff. It's not like I'm going to let Bloody Mary just murder him. It was a split-second decision, and I don't care how it looked. Yeah, uh, thanks, Snow, for all the... <laughs> one BB no for one Crane. Thanks. You're not pissed that Crane's flown the coop? Or that the crooked man thinks he's got snow under his thumb? We're all mad about it, Colin. But it's not like we had a strong... Let's help Snow. Today. What else could Snow do? She didn't hand him over. My ass would be down the witching well. Crane still would have been taken. Okay, okay, I'll take your word for it. Suck it, big. Right now is just what does the crooked man want out of this? I thought he was just a loan shark, but clearly he's operating in other circles. It can't just be about Crane, right? Getting him out of town? Is this all about the murders? Crane can't be useful to him anymore. Yeah, no. what could this have I have no idea what's going on. Crane was a puppet, and the crooked man worked the strings. This is all about control of Fable Town. But then what do prostitutes have to do with it? Lily? And Faith? They know too much? I don't know how it all works out yet, but I know it does. Somehow. The crooked man declared war against us last night. At least that's what I thought when it happened. But now I see this war has been going on for years. We just haven't noticed it because our way of doing things is broken. We need to do things the right way. What does that mean, the right way? Yeah, what, what do does he mean? Think I mean? 
I don't know, but it suspiciously sounds like your way. Bigby's the one on the front lines. You can't give him a leash. He doesn't work that way. Yeah, wait, what do you mean? What is this right way? We haven't been doing a good job. You and I. Hey. So, starting now, we do everything cut and dried. By the book, straight as an arrow. Pure as driven snow. I'm not I'm the arbiter of Sure you're not. <laughs> this town has enough monsters. What happened last night, what you turned into, it can't happen again. But the one of you furry. Fight monsters. Colin, if I really believed that we needed him to lose his flippin' mind at a moment's notice. We were under attack, Snow. What did you expect me to do? There are degrees. Degrees? I only ever do what's necessary. Really? Well, if that's the case, please explain to Colin why tearing Dumb's throat out was necessary. One less asshole! <coughs> Can't let up until the fight is finished. He was... he was still a threat. Yeah, Big B has blood armor. Sure. Look, Big B, I care about how this is done just as much as I care about it getting done. So for that, you want to give him a handicap? Like the bad guys will worry if shit gets sloppy. Everybody wants Bigby to smile and shave and take a shower. <laughs> Hell, I'm practically the president of the Bigby Don't Be Such a Dick Club. But this is the wrong fucking time to put shackles on. Him. Okay, so they want me to stay behind, not do violence. But I want to do violence. Get the job done. Just let him do it. I'm going to. I'm going to let you do it, okay? It's just that. Now that I'm Deputy Mayor, I need your respect. <laughs> and this situation has to end. What situation? All unglamored fables starting today have to go and stay at the farm. Oh, give me a fucking break. Are you gonna let her talk to me like that? It's been a uh... reason, Colin. And Bigby knows it's for the best of the town. It keeps everybody out of trouble. Look. Everyone just calm down. Yeah, right? calm the fuck I'm down. Calm. I'm not. Tell me right now, what's it gonna be, Bigby? Mm -hmm. I'm not the boss. Don't ask me. Wolf's residence. That's rude. <laughs> okay, what is it? Wolf's residence. Okay, I'll let him know. Thanks. Guess who's waiting in your office right now? Mom. Narissa. Narissa. Oh, that close enough. Yes. Apparently, she told Buffkin that she has something she needs to talk to you about. But that she'll only tell you. What do you think that could be? Uh, Bigby's got an admirer. You uh, always do well with the uh, disenfranchised. She knows something. Yeah, she knows she something. The prostitutes she, know something. And something they're being else. silenced somehow. She does. I should get back to the business office. I've left Buffkin alone for too long taking calls. Oh no, not the monkey. And I should probably change out of these clothes. Consider the discussion tabled, but not over. Okay. You know when you're done with Nerissa. Aye aye, Captain. Ahoy! <laughs> She's a piece of work. Hey, you're not really gonna send me to the farm, are you? I mean, uh -huh. she seemed real serious about it, but I can still hang out here. Right? Uh, I don't no, know. No. She won't come around. She's just... You know, the crane thing hit her hard, and she doesn't really know who her friends are right now. Oh, okay. I get it. Don't worry about it. Thanks, Bigby. <laughs> the pig is pissed at me, too. <laughs> I'm sorry. I gotta be a jerk. It's part of the playthrough. His belly hurt? Oh right, the office. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> it's introduction music. Ha <laughs> 
I gotta get new dance moves. Or maybe not, because I'm lazy. <laughs> Man, I can't wait for the Wolf Among Us 2. I think it's still in development. I think. <laughs> Hello! Hi, Sheriff. Hi, Narissa. Have a seat. Yes, on my lap! <laughs> What we gonna do? He can't even speak, can um, he? Are you okay? You didn't look good last night. I wasn't sure you'd be, you know, around. Well, let's just say I've been better. <laughs> I've been better. <laughs> and then he smokes. Really? People smoke those. Mm -mm. Oh no. She smokes. Thanks. It's ruined what for us, I'm sorry. I know what you did for me, sending me the open arms. I think you want to help me again. There's not a lot that I can talk about. You mm. know that. So that spell crane was trying to break. Not just while you're at work. <laughs> he has a spell. What I mean is, I don't want to waste your time, but I don't want you wasting your own time either. Back in the dressing room, at the pudding and pie, I told you what I was looking for. And you found a way to tell me. You sent me to the open arms. Maybe that'll work. Her yeah. neck. She, she scratched her tried. neck. I just it's the damn ribbon it might work you're here because the crooked man just sent crane to the bottom of my list of worries you have something you want to say about that right these lips are sealed see see I could answer you just like that I wouldn't have had to make that appointment with you no these lips are sealed not. these lips are sealed Sometimes, we have to find our way through life on our own, grasping and fumbling in the dark. I... I used to have friends to help me find my way, but now they're gone, and I don't know what to do. Be gone? Uh, is this making any sense? No, it's not. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm to work? them for charades. I'm sorry. I thought I could do this. I need you to know. I want to help, but... But... But your lips are sealed. Yeah. <laughs> I'm... Her neck. It's her neck. Look, she's always exposing her neck. Ribbons. The body language. Faith four one two. Yeah. Do you like it? No, I hate it. Do you? Yeah, it's beautiful. It was. It is beautiful. That's why you can't tell me anything. It's the ribbon, isn't it? Yeah, it is. And she's gonna die because of it. No, please, please don't. The other woman fate died because of the ribbon, please. Can you pull it? <gasps> Can't we just take the ribbon off? No! What's your seal? What? <gasps> just stay back. You can't do that. Slow down. It's all right. Okay, look, big me stuff, please. Please, don't. I'm sorry. <laughs> it would have been worse if I just okay. pulled it. I get it. So the ribbons, if you take them off, 
I'm sorry. Sorry. I wish I could do something. There is the I'm sorry. If anyone finds out I came here. Oh no. That's probably snow. Eh, it's probably snow. Better confirm anyways. Can you keep this conversation between us? I could be in a lot of trouble <laughs> I'm gonna lie sorry I won't tell no one don't worry thank you <laughs> there is a please we weren't doing anything I swear sorry I just need to talk to the sheriff for a moment please excuse us one minute I might have a new lead for you but I don't know how solid it is beauty and beast called the office just now they said they wanted to talk to you about something. I wonder if they've heard about Crane. Thank you for listening, Sheriff. You should go on to your next business. I don't think you'll be wasting your time. Oh, wait, you don't have to go. It's a it's a, a clue. I have to go there. That was uh Brock. Listen, she has a fucking magic ribbon. It's gonna kill her. What did she tell you? The fucking ribbon. Oh, oh. Did you get anything from her? She couldn't really say anything. The magic that Crane was talking about. It's in the ribbon. It's the fucking Don't ribbon. You take the ribbon off. Or it's how Faith and Lily died. <laughs> okay then. Good work. I don't want so any more people dying. Beast, do you think there's something to it? Is this the right place to look? Yes, 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 yes. Nerissa pointed us there. That's what Nerissa was doing. Telling us to go there. I think she made it as clear as she could have. Finally. Hmm. The right way. You know, Beauty came to me a while back. Oh? She was looking for financial assistance. Mm -hmm. I told her there was nothing I could do, and, and she said that meant she'd have to go somewhere else. Oh no. The lone shark. Bigby, you don't think she meant that she was going to go to the crooked movie? She fucking meant we'll that! Explain why they called. We need to solve this before something else happens. The crooked Hang man on. lend her money because she needed money. And now we are I going there. Other matters to it. There is a nose. Oh my god. This is the best fucking soap opera. All right, let's go. Oh, oh. Oh, they're discussing about her job. Open it. <laughs> Dang it. Hey, look your arm. Oh. What do you want? Well, uh, you're just going around knocking on doors? Maybe. Snow sent me. Said you wanted to talk. Not me. Listen, I've had a shitty don't night. I think you're the only one. And I really don't want to deal with the runaround. Snow said you called and wanted to talk to me. Well, I didn't call. Must have been Beauty. She's been surprising me a lot lately. What she do? And I... So have you, Bigby. Yet what did I do? Sneaking around to secrets. Somehow I'm still the bad guy in this. Well, I hear about it all night long from her. Who is it? Who's there? Look, I'm coming in. So, uh. Let's not get into busting down doors today, all right? <laughs> it's not like you can do that anyways. You're all broken. It's your pal, Big B. Hi, Big B. Please excuse Jealous. me just a minute. Can I talk to you in private? Yes, let's. Okay, they're gonna talk. Ooh! 
Nice place. I really do have the smallest apartment in the woodlands. Nice. It looks like a grandma house though, but I like it. <laughs> Let me um Ah, they're having a couple discussion. I don't have patience for this shit. Uh, Beast is being a fucking baby. I wanna go there. What? What is? Eh, yes. Look. Secret passage? No. Oh look, it's them. Talk about living in the past. Wait, she's Brynneth? She's blonde in here. Sorry, it's been a long night. Yeah, you know what they say. Centuries of marriage come with centuries of baggage. I gotta say, your place, it looks, uh, expensive. Yeah, it does. What do you mean by that? Please. No, really, I want to know. What are you trying to say, huh? I thought you were having money problems, but it doesn't look like you're suffering to me. Is this something about that loan you took out? From the crooked man. Yeah. Know what else to do, so she did it. I called him here, and I want to see if he can help us out. She really did go with the crooked man. Shut the fuck up and let me work. I'm not here, referee. You called me, okay? So cut the bullshit and quit wasting my time. I gotta know one thing first. What if we did have something to say about the crooked man? What if we talk and you don't get it? And all this comes back on us. Oh right. Okay, we they can get into it. We've seen what happens when you cross the crooked man. And I don't know if it's worth it. If you can't give us certain assurances. You think you're the only ones in danger? You have info on that crooked bastard. I need to hear it. Otherwise, I've got better things to do. No, please don't. And tell me what the fuck is going on. Yeah. Ain't so much debt. Look around you. This isn't the way people short on cash live. Look, we're used to a certain kind of lifestyle, okay? We couldn't just give that up. Who <laughs> you used to? <laughs> I see. To turn, and we got in over our heads. There's not a lot of work. They don't know how to work with money. <laughs> if we just lived like. You people gotta learn, man. Money doesn't grow on trees. Pick it up. Hi there, you've reached Beauty. And Beast. And we're out doing something fabulous. <laughs> uh, let me just... <laughs> a day at the beach? Hey, you're not done. <laughs> I should... And we can't come to the phone right now, so leave a message at the beep and we'll get back to you as soon as... <laughs> Humanly possible. <laughs> Their fucking message. Is that the other twin? It sounds like Bluebeard though. Or am I mixing up things? All I care about is how can I find the crooked man? Who do I talk to? Where do I go? <laughs> Ginger. <laughs> Ginger chunk. The lucky pawn. That's where I borrowed the money. The lucky pawn? The crooked man's behind that place. I'd overheard people talking to Jersey about loans before. So when I needed money, that's where I went. Who's Jersey? Who do you deal with? Jersey. You know, the Jersey Devil. Oh yeah. That slimy prick. I didn't realize he was back on this side of the river. The guy who was stealing the apartment? Probably dropping off a loan payment they squeezed out of some poor fable. But never the crooked man. Mainly, it's just regular fables. I can see now that it was a mistake, but I'm not the only one who goes there, you know. I saw the woodsman's axe there just the other day. It was in a display case. Oh. I guess he's hit hard 
times too. He sold it. There's a lot of that going around. I can't imagine he has a lot of marketing. <gasps> yeah, I saw Mary with the ex. Mary must go through that. She had Woody's ex last night. Kinda chopped my damn head off with it. Maybe if you go there, you can sort some things out. I guess I'll go check out the Lucky Pawn. If I can't track down the crooked man there, maybe I can make enough noise that the crooked man will come find me. Hold on, baby. Don't go there. Sounds like you're just going to get beauty in trouble. And... You know that butcher shop, the cut above? It's the place on Tubman Street. Same block as the baker and the candlestick maker. Mm -hmm. Well, I've been delivering packages from there for a while. The thing is, it's for the crooked man. And I don't think it's meat in the packages. You gotta understand. I oh! You have to believe us. We didn't think it would get like this. Listen to me very carefully. Did you ever deliver to the crooked man? Can you give me an address? No. I delivered to places all over town, but never to the man himself. It never seems to be heading to the same place, but it always comes out of the butcher shop. How did you get involved with this? Johan the butcher called. He had a problem with the refrigeration unit one night. But when I finished, it was your pal Mary who showed up to pay me. She said I was reliable. She liked that. And it's the only thing I've been able to pick up. And it's still not enough. I don't want Beauty to have to work, especially not where she was. So you do their dirt work. Look the other way. <laughs> especially work not where she work. was. All she was fine. Stuff. I just want You're a big dumbass. <laughs> give her the kind of life she deserves. You see, you guys she gotta to go watch a program called Poupances no sei das quantas ao minuto. You guys need to learn how to save. <laughs> to a certain lifestyle. All we want is to make this place feel a little bit like home. You wouldn't understand, Bigby. Fuck off. Fuck off. There are a lot of fables who have it a lot worse off than you. Or me, for that matter. So, where are you going? Yeah, grow up. If this all goes sideways, I'd like to know where it's coming from. So there's the butcher shop and the pawn shop. Luck lucky pawn, yeah. This is a hard one. Everything leads to the butcher shop. But the lucky pawn has things. Mm. I think I'm going to the butcher. I wanna know what the crooked man is hiding at that butcher shop. You know, butcher. Once you show up there, word is gonna spread. There may be nothing left for you to see if you go to the Lucky Pawn after. Well, I guess I'll find out. Man, I can only go one place at a time. Wait, I don't know what you're planning to do when you find the Crooked Man, but, but is there any way you could help us out? Uh, yeah. Hmm. Well, maybe Wait. you can make this all just go away. We would really appreciate it. What are they what talking about? Say? You help us out? You're asking me to kill him, aren't you? Is that what you think I do? No, of course not. I mean, I yeah, I could, right. but... <laughs> we just, we know that the crooked man is dangerous. To all of Fabletown. I'm gonna do my job. <laughs> Lucky for you, that might just solve your problems anyway. Yeah, that's what's <sighs> probably gonna happen. Thank you, baby. I'm sure you'll do the right thing. Little vice. No, 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 no. And no. Time, time to kick some meat. Take pity on the rich. <laughs> Keep smoking, yeah. <laughs> Fuck you. Yeah, these guys need to learn how to um, live normally and save. Uh, ticket, sign. Frozen meat. I don't. Wait a minute.
Oh, okay, I think I think we're good. <laughs> They're used to a certain lifestyle. <laughs> Bunch of pricks. <laughs> Just be normal. It will uh, do better for them. <laughs> Bell, counter. Let me just look at the sign. I don't think it will trigger anything. Sandwich. Oh, kebab. No, uh, I, I didn't read. I think the fuck is this? Kebab. Kielba. Kielbaya salami. Yeah, never mind. <laughs> Are those sausages what they take for from the people who don't pay? <laughs> you know, <laughs> maybe. Big big wolf. <laughs> well, welcome, sheriff. Uh, what can I get for you? He knows something. You're interested in a particular cut? <clears throat> <laughs> we have in stock let's uh let's see what we got here plank steak on special <laughs> new york strip uh, oh i can have some wild boar in tomorrow if you like uh sirloin rib let's not talk about roast, beast tongue got some tongue here i know bloody mary hangs around here i want to talk to her i uh, i don't know what you mean <laughs> What you see is what you get. The uh, alarm so button. Meat. Go find anything else. Look. We just uh, we do more wholesale and meat packing than walk-up service. I'd like to help you. Really, I would. But there's uh, nothing here. You better stop fucking around, butcher. I'm I'm not. I am not fucking around. I can tell just by looking at it that your meat ain't selling. If you're lying to me. I'm gonna find out. I... Sheriff, I... Did you hear that? <gasps> what? Yeah, the button! Oh, I'm real sorry. Hold on. I, I just gotta go check on that. Don't I'm fucked. Anyway. I'll be right back. Butcher, I just have to go see. I'm fucked. He called the police. That's the sound of the police. Whoop, <laughs> whoop. Yeah, he did that. Yeesh. I got it covered back here, Sheriff. I'll be right out. Yeah, of course you will. You don't touch that meat. Don't make sound. Get him by surprise. I'm sorry, Sheriff, but you're not supposed to be back here for uh, safety purposes. Come on, damn it. How are you that lost? Just punch all over. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Cool. Kill me. Oh, God, she is gonna fucking kill me. Oh, yeah, he's hiding <gasps> something from Mary. He's gonna get me killed. Huh? <laughs> what are you doing? Please, please, me. Please don't. Pick me. What happened to Sheriff? Please don't kill me, Sheriff. Please, please don't kill me. Shut the fuck up. Yeah, you got me in trouble. Fuck you. You, you, you're a lust. You're the one who called the police on me. Why are you doing this? I'm not part of the crew. Explain the fucking button. The crooked man's people. Jersey Devil, D and Dumb, and that mental case Bloody Mary. 
You want to talk about the real butcher? It's her, not me. This is her place. I'm telling you, they muscled in on me. Took over my storage and delivery a long time ago. All because of that heat wave. That summer was even hotter than this one. I'd let Mary and those reporters sneak home with the meat locker one day, playing cards, having a great time. I guess they were sizing the place up. Wait. No. No way. No. No. Sorry. <laughs> I'm just a victim of this. I don't know what they do back there. I swear. And, and I don't want to know. I'm not allowed to know. I knew this would happen. Didn't know when. There. I don't care. They're coming for me. Hurry the oh. fuck up. It's a math lab. <laughs> uh -huh. It's definitely drugs and alphabet and math, whatever it's on that blackboard. And swine's not is a torture room. Is this place? I told you, Bigby. I don't know. It muscled me out. I swear, I don't know anything more. I haven't been back here when it was like this. Warning lights. This business. It's all I've ever had. Damn it. Can't act like you're forced into this and then turn around and help them. Yay! Oh, the button was for them. Switch out there. I had to. Huh. You come in here making trouble for me, but you won't be give a shit now because the crooked man stepped on your toes or something. Where were you when they took this place from me? <laughs> They're all gonna complain that the government didn't help them. You, you think I want to live with this at my back? All right, Johan, do me a favor. Just Shut the fuck up and stay out of the way. Can you manage that? <laughs> oh no, it's a dick in a box. Oh, never mind. <laughs> so this is what Beast was delivering. Glamours, other kinds of magic. Ah. Maybe dangerous stuff. Maybe just don't touch anything back here, please. Didn't I tell you to sit down and shut up? Yeah, maybe they didn't ask, or maybe they asked out of the game. <coughs> that symbol. It's on all the packages. What is it? That's the crooked man's uh, brand. Brand. It's on everything that goes in and out of here. <laughs> so you do know something, huh? Is that a wheel or what? A sun? I guess they never used that thing on wolves, huh? What's that supposed to mean? Mm -hmm. It's from back in the homelands. A torture device. Came over here with the rest of our stories. Oh! Not that Bundy's need any help coming up with that kind of thing. It makes people crooked, like breaking their bones. And do I really need to explain this? Was the crooked man a victim of that? Mm -hmm. Chalkboard. Huh? Looks like. Math or something. Math or math? <laughs> oh. <gasps> what? Shit. Is everybody on here? <gasps> Do you know anything about this? I, I I don't know. A lot of fables out there need a lot of things. E. Vivian. Just beard rose. Red Z, wait to the farm. Z, I wanna. Okay, fate. G D D J D D. What? It's a Jamin. Two, two, three, two. Uh, uh. When a veil. The fuck does a veil mean? This is complicated. I don't think I'll get anything of this. And you won't either. 
mysterious jars. These are raw materials for making magic. Anti green and any other rogue witches out there probably get their supplies here. Wait a minute again. He insisted on complaining at the window, damn it. He cannot. He mustn't. Shush. And I'm going to take a... Uh, yeah, uh, whatever this is. A sucking pill <laughs> or something. But this like it. It's for the throat. Let's continue, sorry. So the other witches, the ones that make legal magic, come here to leather. Shackle. Chains. Who's getting chained up here? Your mom. You can't think I'm the only one the crooked man has under his yoke. <sighs> Maybe to screen. you see what's going on here? All these fables and magic from him. Business is booming. He's got all he needs. Mm. The raw materials. The slave labor to process them. And with all this gear, looks like they could make just about any kind of magic. A lot of it. And it's pretty clear why. Oh yeah? Why? Yeah, why? Doing it like this. It's bound to be cheaper than the 13th floor. This is just horrible. Things that must have gone on here. It's the putting in pie girls with the ribbons. Whoever he's got in here in these chains, he's... He's enslaving fables. It's all a scam. People just don't know the real cost of getting something cheap. You don't have to tell me. <laughs> Fucker, Crane knew all about it. Crane knew? Yeah, what about Crane? With this all, I mean, finding the crooked man is so fucking important. Why don't you ask your boss? Snow. No, Crane. He said he knows where everybody is. I don't know how, but he's got it some way. That's right. It was that creepy magic mirror with the big green head and all. Why don't you just use that? Find the crooked man that way. It's broken. Yeah, with stuff like that mirror, I'm surprised that you ever need to leave the office. Crane shattered the mirror and made off with one of the pieces. Probably still has the shard with him. Well, if they got their hands on an important magical item, there's only one place they take it. <laughs> ah, shit, the lucky pawn. They probably took Crane there, too. The lucky pawn. If I can find the mirror piece there, I can find the crooked man. Hey, hold on! I told you what I knew. And look what you did to me. You're just as fucked up as they are. Hey, you it's Crane's fault! Are, the big bad wolf. Is this what you do? You just go around ruining Fable's lives? Sometimes, there's only one way to do this job. Creative destruction. Man, if Crane wasn't so corrupt, this shit wouldn't happen. I'm gonna have to spend the rest of my short life looking over my shoulder for Bloody Mary. They won't care that I held up my end. If I were you, I'd run. Now I want to get to see the lucky pawn because I could only choose one place. Hey, close. It's funny that Bloody Mary is the real butcher. Hey, don't, don't give me that. What the fuck is the point of having a system if you're just gonna... Hey, my butt, Jack. What the fuck is going on? He... Hey. You're in this shit. If you're lucky, 
love your ass so fucking much. Why'd you pawn it in the first fucking place, huh? I didn't pawn it, asshole. It was stolen from my apartment. You don't want no part of Oh, the ex. You push me one more time, and I will have one hell of a mess on my hands. And I really don't feel like bopping out this. So get the fuck out of my sight. Get the tricks. See you later. Hey, what's going on here? The fucking hell! Christ. And this fucking guy too? Are you kidding me? It was here. It was right fucking here. What did you do with it? Just play Mary. What the fuck do I know? Listen, you bald little dipshit. <laughs> <laughs> you piece of shit. Back it up, Jersey. You're dealing with me now. You got here fast. Still looking for whoever killed them hookers? Or are you done chasing your tail? Where's my axe? Who'd you give it to? <laughs> oh no. That's it? Back off, dog. I just want what's mine. My axe. You talk big. But I don't think you got the stones to back it up. Ow! Still a little sore, are we? Why should Mary get all the fun? You ain't so tough. Punch you sick! <laughs> oh, the needles! <laughs> the timing he hit! The glass he took for! Hello, Rainer! Shut the fuck up, Woody! Oh no. It's the Capra Demon from Dark Souls! Fuck! Run, everyone! It's furry time. Don't even have balls that I can kick. Oh yeah! Time for some massage on the back. I removed my dog couch privilege for the stream time. He is now forbidden to go on the couch. I'm sorry, but hey, and don't, no, 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 no.
No catch privileges. No. He won't stop today. Let's go. Go back to Witcher Tree? Now that's the Capra demon for me. I didn't play much, but I still want to stream the Witcher Tree. Yeah. Missing shard. Where is it? Bloody Mary brought it here, didn't she? Oh yeah. You don't know anything about anything, do you? What do you have? Nothing. Well, I have balls, and you don't. This bitch, Snow White, a broken fucking mirror. No fucking friends. Oh! Next thing you say better be something useful. You can't find a crooked man. No one can. Oh, the door to his house. It bounces around. Never in one spot. You'll never find it. Even Crane had to use the magic mirror. They dumped all his shit here. Bloody Mary uses this place like a fucking dump. Where did they take, it? Where did they take Crane? Oh, how the fuck should I know? They do what they do. You'll never see him again. <laughs> what can I do to convince him? Just go on. Get great shit and go. Not that it's gonna do you any good. Oh, maybe he is. Crane's coat. Yeah, it is. No time for traveler's checks, huh? <laughs> you won't be needing this anymore. <laughs> that sick piece of Ew. The shard. The shard. It's the shard. Finally. Should have gotten here first. Hey, Sheriff. Those girls are still dead. Oh, and there's nothing you could do to bring them back. And I don't know what they did, but I do know this. Oh, if they're dead, it's because the crooked man wanted them dead. That's all it takes. So you can raw smash the place up. <laughs> Shit. You can wail on me all you want. But what good is it gonna do you? Cause he ain't in your town. You're in his. I'm gonna get some serotonin from that. Fuck up, will ya? <laughs> Out of smoke. Give him one. <laughs> he helped me. These two guys have a complicated relationship. <laughs> Shit, friend. <laughs> Fuck you, give me back. <laughs> you want I'm not gonna lie. I was having trouble deciding which one of you to hit with this thing. <laughs> Fucker. What now? Jersey was wrong, you know. About what? About those girls. There is something we can do about it. We can get the fucker who did it. Ah yes, I can. I thought he was gonna say necromancy. Yeah, you're damn right it is. Alright, we'll go do it then. He loves him. He still cares about him. But they're enemies. I don't get it. <laughs> that was low-key heartwarming. I don't care who killed the prostitute. Crane was helping himself to the community coffers. It means his hand was in my pocket. 
Could you just let him go? I don't know what you heard, but it didn't happen like that. Are you denying the facts? She's denying me the chance to get a word in. Now, Miss White, I didn't think she has a Poor girl. Ah, there's the old black and bowl himself. Hippie, where have you been? I'm not finished here, Miss White. You will have to wait. Just one. If she had handed me over, Look the game would have continued, man. Seems your dog wants a biscuit. Fuck you, man. <laughs> Buff him. Get this piece in the mirror right away. With pleasure, Miss White. Go, NFT, go! <sighs> Finally. Things are swinging back in the right direction. Good work, Bigby. Wait, isn't that too small? What did you uncover? I thought you were going to report back to me. I mean, it's fine. Once the mirror's fixed, we can use it to find that crooked bastard. Or at least wherever he hangs his hat. That's how Crane kept tabs on him. And everybody else. I'd say he was abusing the privilege. Yeah, he was probably fucking corrupt. On all of us. He was probably spying on me. Eee, he was yeah, spying on it's Snow. Not, it's fine. You did excellent work. <laughs> no flushable yeah, toys. I could use your assistance. Would you join me at the mirror? Haven't you done it yet? Hurry the fuck up. Don't go far, Sheriff. I'd like to have a few words of my own with you. Why don't you go fuck off until I'm good and ready? <laughs> I don't understand. This piece just doesn't want to join the rest. Do you have any idea why? It's not the same shape. Well, where did you find it? What has it gone through since being separated from the rest? Shattering is a very traumatic experience, you know. <laughs> the... so this process can be a little touchy. It helps that I have a good working relationship with the mirror. I had a front row seat to a pretty gnarly brawl at the Lucky Pond. When I found it, it was still in Crane's coat. The last person I saw with Crane or his coat was that psycho Bloody Mary. Maybe she had some... Ah, yes, Miss White was asking about her. That explains it. You know who and the mirror have a very unhappy history with each other. Oh, she and like the mirror. Use you as a doorway. I think I already know the feeling. Well, I think I know how to proceed now. I think that's how Mary appeared. That's all. Because Thank of the mirror in his coat. Be a while, Sheriff. I'll find you when it's ready. Besides which... He might not want to come out with you watching. <laughs> oh, he doesn't like being spied on. All right, give the mirror some privacy. He's kind of shy. Buffkin's still working on it. He said it might be a while. If you're so self-reliant, what do you want from the business office so bad? What I want is my business. I can't take those two. They're angry at Crane, but Snow has no fault. They're over there bickering about bureaucracy. Mm hmm We're at war. Don't they realize that? Do you need some help over there? Yeah, thanks. Go talk to Toad. But just so you know, we can't pay him. Wait, why does he want he really money? He needs to go to the farm, you know. So just break the news and be done with it, okay? Sheesh, what do I do? Toad, come here. I thought I'd make myself very clear. I see how it is. Passed off to an underling, eh? Why am I surprised? Well, you did cause what damage brings me in here, so maybe it's for the best. Just need a little bit of dosh to cover it. I tried talking to her about it, but it's like chatting up a brick wall, it is. Now, I'm sure you've got your own agenda, Sheriff, but I've taken a real woman because of you. Before we get into any of that, what do you know about the crooked man? Don't try to change a subject on me. I need a little bit of that walking around money, you know? My car, total, the gaping mall in my wall. Oh, Everything right. I'm not looking for her. Wait! Just watch you can me. have the money. Problem solved. Crane won't be getting any use out of this. Will that do? Crane's money, eh? Well, I suppose that means it belongs to me as much as anybody. Thank you, Sherry. Use it to get glamour, too. Got the money now, so I won't be so lenient if I catch you again. And the farm is always on the table. But of course. Yeah, he's gonna waste the money on the hookers and wine. <laughs> Snow is mad. You wanna talk? Now's your chance. I've just made my donation funding this office. So direct your questions to Miss White. Oh. Well, at 
least he's not trying to get rid of me. He's not. For now. Told? Did you take care of Toad? I mean, I saw the way he left. I know it may not seem that important right now, but glamours are the law for a very good reason. Don't worry. I did the right thing. Are you sure? Because he left looking pretty happy. <laughs> His face. Fine. We'll deal with it later. I know I should be asking how it got like this, but I just keep wondering why it happened to Faith and Lily. The ribbon! His world, do you have any idea why he'd want them dead? I don't know if the crooked man killed them with his own hand or if it was one of his goons. If there's one thing I figured out, it's that the crooked man is all about control. It's what he does with the loans at the pawn shop, the magic he peddles, chains, ribbons. Maybe Faith and Lily weren't doing what they were told. Or maybe they just tried to leave. Sheriff, Miss White! I believe the mirror is repaired. Finally! Peace! I have to say, I have been better. But thanks for putting me back together. I'm sorry, I just... I have to know. Mirror, mirror, we're glad you weren't slain. Now please show us that sick creep crane. Fine, give her a minute. Yeah, I want to see where he's ended up. Is he dead? You will get on that plane to Paris, and you will wait for the day the crooked man needs you. Until then, not a peep. Otherwise, I get to deal with you my way. So please, please disobey. Wait a minute. Someone's watching. <gasps> he knows. She knows the mirror. What just happened? We pointed you in the wrong direction. We looked at Bloody Mary's reflection. Oh, her. That explains the sting. I'd rather not have to feel the pain she brings. Damn. So, let's not do that again, okay? Looks like we'll have to track him down later. You're right. We need to focus He's going to Paris, okay, to hide. the crooked man. Bigby, we don't have a lot of time. Uh, mirror, mirror. No time to pout. So, where does crooked man hang out? I don't recognize the door, but that's the crooked man symbol on it. Hold off. <laughs> It changed? Door. It moves. Yeah, Jersey mentioned that. Wait a minute. I know that door. That's Central Park. I don't know when it's gonna move again, but I'm gonna get there before it does. Bigby, wait. Y'all should just get a cell phone. <laughs> Make sure you bring him back alive. He has to stand trial. This can't be like it was with Tweedledum. I don't care if it gets out of hand. You don't let it come to that. I Fuck trial. Can run high, and you have your reasons to handle this a certain way. I can't make that promise. This could turn sour, just depending on how the wind blows. I have to be able to handle it how I see. Yeah. Fuck trial. People are going to have faith in the Sometimes they are the very blind. We need to be fair. Show them that we're doing things the right way. I have enough to worry about here while I prepare the case against him. So I'm going to trust you to handle this properly. That is, if you think you're ready. Of course I'm ready. Ready Freddy! Choice. Central Park. Oh! Action! Quick! Before it disappears! The fucking portal? Oh. oh my. Tiny. 
What are you doing here? I have to admit, when they asked me to watch the door, I wasn't sure what to expect when you came through that portal. But I get it. You're not here on a social call. What is this place? Or where is it? He's evil. He's working for him. I'm He's the sure. guard. I've only ever come in through one of the portals. I don't think you can get in from the actual street. But you can't blame him for wanting to make it hard to find. I'm supposed to bring you right on in, so if you'll come this way. Look, this is the one thing I have to do. Please don't make this hard on me. I don't want to get in trouble. Fine, lead on. Hmm, I don't like this guy. He's suspicious. I mean, he's the Thanks guard for Crooked Man. I'm here to do, and I don't want to mess it up. <laughs> I know I'm probably the last person you expect to be a guard, or an escort for that matter. I was a little surprised myself when they asked me to do it. Tim, how can you be working here? You know who this guy is, don't you? He's not. He's not as bad as you think. He doesn't treat me like some broken little kid. I think he gets what it's like. He's, He's using you, job. man. And I'm lucky to have him. This is the only option I've got. Just keep that in mind, maybe? No, you need to find another job. He's using you. The rest of Fable Town is gonna get caught in the middle. I understand the position, but you don't have to do this. There are other things you could do. So it's just that easy? Maybe not, but you don't want to be a part of this. A lot of us depend on him. Some of us never get to the front of the line at the business office. But he's there. We need you, but we need him too. Well, Crane is not here anymore. You guys can do things hey, legally. Hold up. I gotta go in with you. I don't have time for this. You're being used. I'm sorry, kid. God bless us everyone. They all complain that the crooked man helps them, but it was because of Crane. And Crane was like that also with the help of crooked man. So no Crane, no crooked man. It all goes back to normal. I don't know if I can kick it. Do I have strength? What the fuck? Holy shit. Oh yeah. <gasps> the 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 other girl. I was you. When you turn up. You know, Tim would have been happy to have let you in. Fuck Tim so and fuck sorry, you. It's all right, Tim. I shouldn't have expected the sheriff to give you respect enough to do your job, but you did fine. You can go now. You see, everyone in Fable Town has a role to fill. You just have to pay attention to what they need to help them find it. I don't listen to don't Mafia Dude. What's the girl doing here, too? <laughs> Swag, smoke. Yeesh, that sound effect. I don't. Ah! Next time! I've heard stories about you. In the old days, how you picked off those men one by one. Oh, how it's The wolf is coming. And they would wait. Hiding anywhere they could squeeze their pathetic, shivering corpses. Some would just drop to their knees where they stood, close their eyes, and wait for death. And you'd give it to them. <laughs> I wish I could have seen it. Oh, well. <gasps> oh! Damn it! When things get interesting, it's boom. 
wait until the next chapter. Let's see what we did here. Did you send Colin to the farm? Most of you did not. Damn it, I'm doing a bad bad job as a jerk. Uh, okay, most did not remove. Most and most. <laughs> okay, we were the small percentage of swag that decided to smoke. Okay. Uh, let's see, what time is it? Five! It's only five. Mmm, man. I don't know, I feel tempted to make something more. The live stream was very short, but at the same time, I want to save my voice because I have a live stream planned on Valentine's Day. <laughs> So uh, I think uh, I'm gonna skip the credits, I'm sorry, I can't concentrate. I think I'm gonna end it here anyways, and take some rest of my voice. Uh, so then we can continue on Valentine's Day, if you can appear. I'm not gonna read the entrances either, I'm sorry, because of my voice. The next time we play Wolf Among Us and I'm probably better, I'll, I'll read them for you. Let, uh, let me see. These are just the achievements. Oh, nice drawing. These are just drawings. Did we unlock that many characters? Nine. Nine characters. Yeah, the, the time flew by. <laughs> well, since you guys are here, I'm gonna give you a little spoiler alert for what I'm gonna do on Valentine's Day on the stream. It's gonna be my first, <laughs> my first drawing stream. I'm gonna draw a couple of things. It's gonna be, well, it's gonna be more chatting and you guys won't, uh, it won't be like an art class. I don't know actually what do people expect when watching art streams. Do they expect to learn? Do they just like to hang out? Do they like to... Uh, I don't know. I have no idea. <laughs> In my opinion, like I have no patience to watch art streams or speed paintings. I, I can't sit in place. I, I'd rather be drawing myself. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> but... I'm not gonna be making artistic art. It's, it's gonna be drawing, but it's not gonna be that artistic. All right, I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna be making Valentine's cards. The, a lot of them, a lot of them with jokes and pickup lines. Uh, just to be funny, you know? And to try to give everyone I can something nice. So, um, <laughs> I hope that goes well. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for joining me. I'll see you guys on the next stream on day 14. At least I will have that live stream. Uh, the rest I don't know. <laughs> but thank you and I see you then. Bye bye!